Relay for Life is a fundraising walk for everyone to participate and either celebrate being a survivor or to walk for a loved one that lost the battle. The event is centered in fundraising money to find a way to fight cancer and end it for good. The survivors are the ones to walk the first lap around the track to celebrate their victory against cancer. But in a crowd of survivors, there is one in particular who has gone through a benign brain tumor and even hydrocephalus. It all started when Madeline Rosick was about five weeks old. Her head circumference was abnormal, so doctors ran tests only to find out that she had hydrocephalus. Last year, at the beginning of the fall semester at SFA, she had to rush back to Houston and get urgent surgery because things started going wrong, and she basically stayed a whole semester at home, wishing she could come back to SFA as soon as possible to keep going with her studies. At the age of 16, she was told by her nearest surgeon that she had a benign brain tumor the size of a jelly bean. Rosek said that luckily it has not grown in five years, which the doctors confirm as a great sign. So far, she has had 10 surgeries, which according to her, is pretty good comparing to other people. Even though she has gone through many surgeries and doctors, she does not let anything stop her from smiling, dancing, and walking to not only celebrate her being a survivor, but also to walk for her grandmother, who after many years lost the battle to cancer. Rosek got to decorate the bag that was illuminated in her grandmother's memory. She holds her mama, as she calls her, very close. Madeline and Rosek will keep on fighting, keep on smiling, and keep on going with her studies until she graduates. For East Texas Explorer, I'm Consuelo Bonilla.